For today's video, we highly recommend you to prepare these following items. Spoons. Size doesn't matter. Reeds. It could be either a carry or synthetic reed. A mouthpiece. A ligature. Could be any ligature. And a saxophone player. Now, let's begin our video. Welcome to V and A TV. Today we are going to talk about slap tongue. So what does it mean? Slap tongue is actually a percussive sound. So we make slap tongue by using our tongue. We collapse in our tongue like this, and make a section on our reed like this, Boop. and then by releasing the section, we hit the reed against the mouthpiece. I will demonstrate. Like this? Yeah. How did you learn slap tone? I started to learn the slap toning when I learned the piece by Pedro Itzraide the Chardash. In the cadenza there is a small motif of the main theme which you must play in slap toning. But of course for the competitions I didn't take a risk, I just play a simple detaché. But after after the competitions, after the co concert, I've learned finally how to how to get this by suggestions of my teacher. So it took me lots of time actually. And after this, I've I've started to learn the piece Jungle by Christian Loba. That's a etude that dedicated to slap playing. It's a good example when you don't know how to play slap tone. Just take a piece which includes many many slap mm -hmm. and you, you will try it hard. Thank you for sharing Valentin. Actually it was my case too. Um, I started by not knowing how to play slap tongue at all. And at the beginning I was just tying the reed like normal and I was like why? Why it's not slapping? But then I made myself a goal to play a piece with slap tongue which was also jungle that you mentioned before. I was also preparing for a competition. And I started off with using a spoon because my professor was recommending me to like try to get used to the section um, of the town. Once we get used to making the section from our town, it becomes a lot easier when you do the section on the reed. Today, we have prepared several exercises for you guys to learn how to do the slap tongue. The first exercise that we prepare for you is a spoon exercise. In order to practice the following exercise with your practice buddy, you should prepare a spoon with you. The second exercise is exercise with a reed. It could be any reed you want, plastic or cane. And the following exercise, we're gonna upgrade it to um, play with a mouthpiece and with the neck of the saxophone. So there's a one very important point for this exercise. We are not yet form our embouchure, which means that we're gonna leave our mouth open. And we have not yet put any air pressure in the mouthpiece.
Next exercise we're gonna play with our saxophone. We're gonna play F major scale but still without air pressure. Congratulations everyone! Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. <laughs> now we're moving on to the next exercise which we're gonna use the same F major scale but now we're gonna blow the saxophone as normal and play the whole scale with slap tone For the next exercise, we're gonna speed up our tempo and we're gonna switch to C major scale. Last but not least, we're moving on to our last exercise for today. This time we're gonna increase our tempo to 120 and we're gonna do it on one note. So we just try to concentrate on our slap toning and don't uh, think about scales or anything. After this tempo, you can also challenge yourself to speed up to any tempo as you wish. But don't worry if you will need a lot more time to find the right position of your toning. You can always bring a plastic reed or just a normal reed with you and practice wherever you are. Mm -hmm. In the or bus, a spoon. in the bus or in the kitchen while you're eating, while you're waiting for the food. And just, just keep in mind that you have to know this motion better. So you just need to practice every day, mm -hmm. about 5 minutes at least. Feel free to replay any exercise that we just did today. Everyone is different and each one can take different time to get used to each step of the learning process. Remember, you're not alone. We've been there. Okay, I'm hungry. That's it for today. Thanks for watching this video. And see you soon. Love you. Love you. Bye.